hey hello guys welcome back so in this video i we will be learning uh, one of the important question of python and this question i got from a uh, linkedin okay so i thought to share with you guys so the question is that write a method that takes a number as parameter and generates multiple application table for that number so you can see you know if we give here 5 then we will be receiving like you know 5 into 1 is equal to 5 5 into 2 is equal to 10 and so on so on so on so here they have mentioned till 10 so we will make uh, our program dynamic so you know there we will be passing two parameters like you know one is this number and uh, what is the range you know till what number we need a table right so let's see how we can do it's a very pretty straight problem okay so if you know you know the logic you know how you can iterate the loop then you can understand easily so what i'll do i'll just create one function let's say f underscore multiplication and here i will pass two parameters that is one for number that is for five right and second thing is second thing is range so let's say i am saying that i want to iterate or i want a table till 10 number right so i will uh, you know add here x now i'll just start in initiate a loop let's say for i in uh, what range range will be from which to which range will be from 1 to x plus 1 because i i cannot keep here 0 right 0 in a table we do not have any multiplication of 0 right so it st starts from 1 and it goes till it goes till you know it goes till the number so that's why i added x plus 1 because it is implicit sorry because it is explicit that's why i added here x plus 1 also right now it's simple just do a print and here i can do what i can use formatting so i'll just write here 0 not 0 directly this mm, x right x again and here i will choose format so if i choose here format then if i choose here format then you can see here i have to pass the number so number will be like x comma i if i'm not wrong so and let me just you know run this so we'll see whether it's working or not and let me just call the function now so here i will pass here 5 and let's say i'm passing here 10 so now it just give us you know this this thing like this is string 5 into 1 5 into 2 and so on so on so on cool but it is not completed yet i need to also print this right so how i can do i can use here comma equal to cool and uh, uh, shall i do that way mm, no cool and here i will you know write it down what i into n and if i just run it now then you can see it is printing like this so let me just remove this spaces so it will work it looks you know perfect now you can see 5 into 1 is equal to 5 10 so on so on so on cool so i hope that you have understood this now let me just change it to you know 20 and let's see whether it's it's working or not now you can see it's working perfectly fine and if i have to change the number also let's say if i'm printing here 2 so you can see over here that we are we are we are having the uh, you know uh, table from 1 to 20 cool so this is the this is the one way to do and maybe you know you can reduce this loop into i mean we have these two lines you can also use a, a single line also right so this is just one example or you know one uh, one question which was asked in recent interviews what i received from uh, linkedin right so i hope that you have understood this okay and thank you bye bye